Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, we are gonna be talking about Emmy, the joyful calendar app. If you have ever been to its website, I know you might be hyped up a lot about this application. This is a calendar application that promotes itself as a joyful calendar app. It has two do's here and you can schedule these two do's in your calendar. And the design is very beautiful. Just going through the website, you will feel that they have done a lot of work on design. But they also have a lot of features as you can see here and i've got an early access to the beta version of this calendar app i mean the joyful productivity app and let us see what we have got in this calendar app and see if it lives up to our expectations or not or see if it can be used in our daily lives or not let us go to our emmy calendar right now i'm on my windows device and i don't have a apple device so it is not available as an app so it is a web app here but if you are mac user or ios user it is available for you here we have got the calendar let me go to a broader view here week view i'm starting to use more of a calendar because as they say if it's not in your calendar you are probably not gonna do it and here's i think a new version is available over here and let us update this let us see what we have got in the new version first and they are improving pretty quickly and here are some features like weekly view on ios app you can track your sleep habits in the calendar that's cool if you are an iOS, ios user now let's see what we have got here this is the calendar view calendar view right let me switch to the light mode so that it becomes easy for you to see and here is our calendar and here are some lists that you can create and you can drag these tasks from this list that's cool you can also add list like this this is a new list so you can create task over here and you can also color code this these lists so what this does is differentiates different tasks or different category of tasks in your calendar if i drag this over here you can see the cal the task is of different color than these other tasks so this is a simple to do mixed with calendar and this is one feature that is missing in google calendar and here you can add a multiple time zone i have got two time zones here i'm just gonna delete it from here the first one is my local time zone Kathmandu, and i can add another time zone let's say new york time zone just and here you can see We've got another time zone just like Google Calendar you can see a lot uh, more views over here three day view five day view and a daily view that looks good design wise one of the feature I like about this is the share availability feature let me just go to week view right here and if I go to share it will allow me to create share links and let me select specific slots okay you can either choose the all slots or select specific slots let's say I want to select slots from this time tomorrow and I can create a scheduling link over here and I can share this with other friends or people that want to have a meeting with me if I send them the scheduling link this will what it will look like to them and it looks beautiful here you can see we have got the scheduling link meet with fracas location when here are the time slots that are available uh, 30 minutes time slots there are six uh, four five 30 minutes time slot select a time slot add the names and email here click on confirm and an event will be confirmed on your calendar let us go back to our emmy calendar and see what we have got here you can see here is the meeting scheduled over this time slot so this is another feature and there are some beautiful features in this app as well such as the contacts feature i like the social aspect of this calendar application you can see where you have when you have done some meetings or when you have previously met you can keep a note for yourself to remember about about that particular contact you can schedule a reminder you can add a birthday and if the other person also uses ami you can see these other information like twitter handle spotify and location as well let us go to our settings over here and see what we have got you can go to profile and see this is your profile add your twitter handle click on next you can add multiple accounts over here 
currently it only supports google google calendar so you can only add google calendars mm, if you click on next here are general settings choose your start day sunday monday time format red format enable working hours these are some features that, that you might want to see in your calendar and here we have got the calendar light mode and dark mode let us choose dark mode and you can also choose the default meeting provider for when you create those scheduling links you can give access to your zoom account or google meet or any other service you use to directly create meeting links for you there are some shortcuts and if you see the download apps option it is only available for mac and ios as of now but they are also building on android and i hope they also do for do it for windows and here is the worst new feature that i previously showed you and they are improving pretty quickly i think for me to personally use me there are a lot of features that need to be added as well the first having a windows app the second is quick capture feature for tasks so that i can just use the keyboard shortcut to add a task and i don't have to open the app directly so that is a must have for me if i want to switch to this calendar but looking at the visual aspect i think there is no calendar app in the market that can beat me as of right now so uh, this was a simple first look of the me the joyful calendar app i hope you like the video and if you like the video please subscribe to the channel because i'll be coming with more videos like this in future thank you for watching